Hello everybody, it's you, the Exceptional Gamer here, bringing you another Fortnite Battle Royale video, and uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, the mechs are still in the game. Epic Games have really gone and done it this time when it comes to pissing off the community, because if they make any post about Fortnite, any post regarding the game at all, whether it be an update, a new content edition, you did anything like that, okay? They get absolutely demolished, they get fully destroyed by the whole community on Twitter just absolutely talking them down. You know, a lot of the comments usually involve things like, vault the mech, why is the mech not vaulted? Vault the brutes, you know, and then there's like all the hashtags, and rightfully so, I actually am on the community side, although I think some people go a bit far about it, but they are obviously the, the bad eggs that I guess don't really matter. Okay, so I know I've already done a video talking about the mechs and just complaining about them, and whilst this probably is going to be another one, I just want to have a bit more of a topic around this thing regarding how much this is actually damaging the community and I know it's kind of obvious but I mean I think we just need to talk about what can happen if mechs stay in the game for the long run. Something I've noticed about the Fortnite community is if there is something added in that you know as a as a majority we don't like we will let epic know all right whether that be in the worst ways or really good ways such as very like constructive criticism and everything and they do listen most of the time but it takes them a while to actually do something about it whereas this this mech problem is becoming a huge issue now I mean, we're what, like three weeks into Fortnite Season 10, and mechs, which are absolutely destroying the game and really killing the mood for everyone, are still roaming around. With the amount of spam on Twitter comments, the amount of Reddit posts getting thousands of upvotes, you would think surely Epic Games must have done something. I mean, clearly the majority of the community doesn't want these things in, like, it's honestly just crazy. I mean, surely they have seen all of the Reddit posts, just everything like that. And th now it's just getting to the point where they're being stubborn. Many people are saying that because it is, it's just very true. They are clearly seeing these posts, clearly seeing all the comments to them posts and their own on Twitter and all the YouTube videos that have been made. And they are seeing them because how can you avoid them? They are everywhere and they are saying, no, we're keeping them in and i get why because you know there's challenges but maybe just change them and make us have to do different things for them and get the same rewards and when epic games start being stubborn like this and really just pretty much ignoring the community people either drop out of fortnite overall you know they uninstall the game there's been streamers that have done that there's been many people that have surely done that and there's also people that just turn very toxic and start being very mean towards Epic to the point where it's kind of uncalled for, but they can just prevent all of this if they just throw the community a bone. I mean, I know they're the game developers here, but I think the people who play the game more than them know what's right for the game, or at the very least just know how to make the game feel fair. Seriously, I have looked on Google Trends and Fortnite is declining, okay, I'll, I'll even put the stats up. It's just crazy because all the Fortnite content creators I can safely say are getting sick of this and like as one myself and I'm not even one of the big people either I'm a very small channel I'm really fed up of it like if you haven't noticed lately my Fortnite content has been so spaced out and it's ever since all these really negative changes started coming into the game because a lot of the community are jumping ship fortnite is on its decline it is on its way down and that is so scary because like i really enjoy the game i mean maybe not as much now but it was it is a very special game i mean it has so much going for it now on the other hand I will make the argument that mechs are fun to use and it's actually keeping more people in, but just from a, a look on many social medias regarding Epic Games, I can, I'm just going to make a very educated guess here that a lot of people and still the majority of people don't like the mechs. I'm not even going to be proud of Epic Games if or when 
they actually vault the mechs. Uh, in fact, I don't even want them vaulted. I want them completely gone. I don't ever want to know that they are in the vault just and they can come out at any time. And to be honest, I don't really think that they can be counted very well or balanced. So in conclusion, I just wanted to get my point across about how the mechs are really damaging the community like more and more every single day that passes and they're still in the game we are on the decline all right fortnite is on its way down and even if the game doesn't fully die i think that it's gonna lose a very big chunk of dedicated fans a lot of people just haven't been playing the game as much including myself i've been playing apex legends minecraft it's just games like that that just just at this point seem way better and if epic are gonna do something to get the community back and get fortnite now, in the state I think we all want it to be at again, then they need to do something fast. Now, I don't want to keep this video too long, so I'm just going to leave it here. I've got my point across. I really don't want to see Fortnite fail because I love the game so much, but lately, I, what are Epic Games doing? But if you enjoyed, be sure to smash that like button, comment and subscribe for more. It really helps a lot. Turn on the notification bell too. Epic, stop being stubborn. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.